So today, let's look at the multiplication table in base 5. So it is no longer in base 10. So we are not looking at base 10, not base 10. So we we'll look at the multiplication table in base 5. And we know the numbers in base 5 are 0, 1, 2, 3, and what? 4. So this thing that I'm going to solve now, all of them, the answers there, we will be having the numbers 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4. 1 times 1 is 1. 1 times 2 is 2. 1 times 3 is 3. 1 times 4 is 4. 1 times 5. Will I write 5 here? No. Because there is no number in base 5 that is 5. So we are whatever we get, 1 times 5, 5. We have to divide what we get by the base we are working with. That is 5. So when we have 5 divided by 5, that will leave us with what? 1 remainder what? 0. So we write the remainder 0, we carry the whole one, the whole number 1. You see, 2 times 1, 2. 2 times 2, 4. 2 times 3, 6. We will not write 6 because there is no number in base 5 that is what? 6. Does it make sense? So we have to divide 6 by the base we are working with. That's 6 all over 5. And that will give us 1 remainder what? 1. Can you see it? So write the remainder 1, we carry the whole. So we have one, remainder what? One. So one, we carry the whole, we'll write it. Two times four, eight. We will not write it. So we'll do eight divided by what? Five. So that will give us one remainder three. So write the remainder first, three. Bring down the whole, which is what? One. Can you see it? So the next one, two times five, ten. We'll do ten divided by five. That will give us two remainder zero. Hope is clear. So write the remainder 0, carry the whole 2. So the next one, 3 times 1, 3. 3 times 2, 6. We will not write 6. We will still do 6 divided by 5. It will give us 1 remainder 1. We are not doing a reason because there is no number in base, in base 5 that is 6. So our answer will still be 1 remainder 1. 3 times 3, 9. We will have to do 9 divided by 1, 5. And that will give us 1 remainder 4. So write the remainder 4, bring down the whole, which is what? 1. In other thing, 3 times 4 is 12. So we have to do 12 divided by 5. We give us 2 remainder 2. So write the remainder 2, bring down the whole, which is still 2. So 3 times 5, 15. 15 divided by 5 will leave us with 3 remainder what? 0. We write the remainder 0, bring down the whole, 3. 4 times 1 is 4. 4 times 2 is what? 8. 8 divided by 5, we had that it is 1 remainder 3. Write the remainder 3, bring down 1. 4 times 3, 12, which is 2 remainder 2. We write the remainder 2, bring down the whole 2. 4 times 4, 16. 16 divided by 5 will give us what? 3 remainder 1. So write 1, bring down the whole 3. 4 times 5, 20. 20 divided by 5 will give us 4 remainder 0. Can you see it? So, Give me the answers to what? The five. Do you understand? Please have a nice day. Like, comment, share, and follow Courses Academy. Bye bye.